fellow guitar slingers, welcome back. Josh Rogers here. I'm super excited about today's video. For me, this is the first time I've had a chance to really let you hear what the Fractal Audio AX8 is all about. I've been spending about uh, a few hours with it every day, and I think I've come up with what I think are the three most versatile patches that will allow you to just get out there, plug this thing in, and play about 90% of songs from you know all kinds of different genres. What I've found is that the AX8 is a fairly daunting piece of equipment. There's so many things that you can do with it. You can change the cabinets, the amps, the power supply, mics. There's just so much tweaking that's in there and it can be a little bit off-putting. I did have some previous experience programming my G uh, Boss GT10 and uh, it's just a totally different ball game. I mean, you know, of course there's some similarities, but the AX8 is just so more advanced. I mean, it's eight or nine years since the Boss was released. It's still a great pedal, nothing wrong with it. But the AX8, it's another beast. And I found that I just wanted to plug it in and play. Uh, I didn't want to get bogged down in all of that stuff. Not initially anyway, I'm going to do that later. But uh, yeah, I just wanted to plug it in and just let this thing rip. The three patches that I thought are the most versatile, uh, I'm going to go from clean uh, through to the high gain one. So. I start off with the USA Clean. So you may be thinking, how can you get through you know, all these songs with just the three patches? But in all honesty, the majority of songs have three different sounds. You've usually got a clean one, a crunch, and then high gain for solos and leads and that kind of thing. Don't forget also, you can use your pickup selector if you have one on your guitar. So here we are, patch number one, the USA Clean. Great sound, great sound. There's a little bit of compression. Some chorus and a multi-delay in this one. For another added tone, I've changed pickups to the second second position. It's not as strong, but it's a little bit cleaner. If you want a more of a jazz, thick, creamy George Benson-esque tone. So moving on, now we have my personal choice of patch number two, which is the Super Crunch. This is bang number five, preset eight. You know, when I hear this patch, I just think Brian Adams, Summer of 69. Nice and crunchy, not too much gain, right in the middle. You can use it for... Something by Dire Straits. And depending how much attack you give it, you can get a bit more gain uh, to come through. to the neck pickup. That crunch comes through even more.
All right. The moment you've all been waiting for, my choice of high gain or a lead type patch. And it's the Brit Pre-Clean, which is uh, bank number 10, preset 4. Uh, for me, this just had the right balance of everything. It's got a bit of digital delay. Uh, it's got a nice reverb in there. And yeah, I think it's pretty versatile. That's why I've chosen it. So this is what it sounds like. That's on the uh, bridge pickup, if I switch to the neck pickup. Just spent hours doing this. <laughs> As you can hear, it's a pretty awesome patch and it's straight out of the box. I haven't done anything to any of these three patches that I've been talking about today. They are exactly what they are, so you can just plug in your guitar and you're ready to roll. So I'm going to leave you with that. That's the end of my video for today. I hope you've enjoyed it. I hope you get some use out of these patches. There's so many things you can do with the AX8. I'm going to be doing a few more of these as time passes. So stay tuned. If you like my video, please press like. And if you want to hear more from me, uh, leave a comment and subscribe to my channel. Cheers. Let your fingers fly.